Today, I pray that you'll feel the companionship of God. And when you do, you're going to have quite a day, a new day, a new experience. Listen to what it says in 2 Corinthians 5, verse 17. Therefore, if anyone is in Christ, he or she is a new creature. The old has passed away. Behold, the new has come. Now, I talk all the time in the pages of the day-by-day gratitude to God system about living in the present and being grateful for the blessings of the present day. Yesterday is past, and tomorrow it is but a dream. But today, that's tangible. That's here. And it holds for you unlimited promise of good things from God. Determine right now, with me watching this, to attune yourself to God's companionship this day. That changes the day. God's companionship. As you're aware of God's presence with you, you're going to be aware of new beauty and new good in your surroundings as familiar as they are. You're going to view each activity with a new vision from your eyes. You're going to perceive fresh opportunities. You're going to have unprecedented possibilities in your life, teeming fulfillment. Listen attentively in this day. And you're going to hear a wonderful symphony of life revealed in the song of a bird or the melody of kind words of a friend. Here is our positive affirmation for today. I acknowledge. I accept. I appropriate the blessings of today. Yesterday's disappointments, well, they are nothing in the light of God in today. Today is absolutely bright with promise. Today offers a fresh start, a clean slate, hope, joy, a new beginning, unlimited good for you. And you know why? Because that's what God offers, and God is your companion. 